Monday, February 20th. We flew in yesterday and we're going on our first little morning beach walk. It's nice out here. Yeah, I actually feel comfortable in my little bikini and my, I had some shorts on too. And uh... Those units are cool. What? Oh, the bottom? Yeah, the grass walk out. Yeah. So this is actually the place that we're staying at. I showed like a little clip of it. Yesterday it's called Crystal Dunes. And this is the other side of it that faces the ocean. Or somewhere, one uh, of those. That one right, right there. Yeah. It's actually really nice for laying out. But we're gonna go on a quick little walk. Oh, they got chairs right here. Oh yeah, that's what my brother was saying yesterday that some people were leaving chairs. I think it's like 70 degrees today. Wow. It's been a minute since I felt the sand. Uh, it's nice and warm. Are you sure we shouldn't leave our shoes like hidden somewhere? Yeah. Because then we're going to have to hold them. I can't believe how warm it feels right now. This is our cute little walkway to the beach. And that's my cute view. These are some other places along the beach here. We actually stayed in that unit last year if you watched the vlogs. And now we're staying in this one. We wanted to stay there, but it was just too crazy expensive. It just happened to work out for us last year that we were able to stay there because of like a cancellation and stuff. If you saw that vlog, you already know what I'm talking about. But yeah, we're staying here and we love it. Definitely would recommend. Okay, I got myself kind of put together. I look really red in this lighting through the camera for whatever reason, I don't know. I just threw on like a little simple outfit, nothing special because we're just gonna go grab some food and haven't ate or anything yet today. It's like one something or is it? Shirts Patagonia. <laughs> is it maybe Pants two? Pants are Adidas. <laughs> okay, with the Shoes plug. and Nike. Looking like a million bucks. Why do we look so red in here? Look at through the camera. We look like we got sunburnt. Maybe we are. I don't feel sunburnt at all. I sat outside for like five minutes. I don't know, I think it's just this bathroom lighting. I don't know, I don't feel like I sat outside that long. But yeah, we did our little beach walk this morning, then we sat on our little balcony for a hot minute, filmed an audition for this guy, and now we just got kind of ready, not really, honestly. <laughs> just threw some clothes on. And like I said, we're gonna grab some food.
starting out strong in the back porch. It's one of our favorite spots. <laughs> the next day and as you could tell Devin got in the water he said it felt pretty good we just did a little morning beach walk again now I'm just putting myself together a little bit because we're gonna go I think down to Baytown Wharf that's what the area is called anyway do a little walking around and stuff they have some different shops and restaurants and just a cool little vibe down there I'm going to wear the hat because my nose is sunburnt and I'm trying to keep it out of the sun even though it's like not really sunny today. Yesterday we just kind of like chilled as well. Um, as you saw we went to the back porch and we got some really yummy food. I got the Amberjack fish sandwich which they are like known for there. And then Devin got the Mahi Mahi Destin special which was really good. It had like some shrimp and stuff on it. Definitely would recommend that as well. I don't know if that's like a year round thing or not because it was like on their special menu. So we just ate there and we came back, and just like hung out in the condo, sat on the balcony, watched the sunset. And that was our day yesterday. And that's kind of what we've been doing so far today is just like chilling in our place. Oh, I got some pants on and this shirt I had on earlier because it's kind of chilly today. A little windy action. So I just got the Converse. He's like white and a cream jeans. And then this little blue pullover because like I said, it's a little windy today. What did you think of the food yesterday? It was delicious. I thought so too. You have Q-tips? Yes, should. yeah I do. I remembered to bring some. <laughs> like that's the thumbnail. I always look at, you always look at the Q-tip after, you know? I have to. Yeah. Oh, my hair looking at that. That's not bad. Not bad at all, actually. Use all your might to shut that freaking door. Uh, what if it rains? <laughs> all right. So we just got back to our condo. We walked around for a little bit at Baytown Wharf, kind of got the atmospheric vibes there because we haven't seen that in a while. It's always fun to go there and see some different stuff and looks like they got a few new things in that little area. And then we, because we were already over in that area, we decided to go eat at P.F. Chang's, got a little bite to eat. And now we got back to the condo and we're getting our steps in because I think we only have like three miles in so far. So we need to work this food off for eating. A lot of salty stuff. Left me in the dust. <laughs> I told you I got warm. Wait, which way are we going? Oh, okay. 
gonna try to track you down. I only got as far as guitar town. Singing about a girl I used to know, used to know, used to know. That I haven't given up, I'm just on your radio. Chasing you like a star and this is the place we stayed at last year. She was a beat. And now the place we're staying at this year is literally just right over there. I love just walking on the strip and looking at all the cute little homes. Nothing like a walk and a shoulder massage. Oh yeah. They're growing up everywhere. Well it's kind of going to look like peace lilies. Yeah. The leaves on them anyway. Sun today. It's now 10:30, and I think the plan today is to go to Shell Island, which I didn't even know was a thing. My parents found out about it, and it's like a little island off of Panama City Beach. So I guess I were in Destin, so it's like about an hour to Panama City Beach, and then you take a shuttle to this Shell Island place, and that we've never been before, never heard of it. At least I haven't. So just gonna try something new today, and. I'll take you all. Also, this is my little OOTD, my long jean shorts. I like how they go past my knees. And I got this little crop top on. Well, it wasn't a crop top. I cut it into one. I got this extra large men's shirt from Goodwill. And I did a little snip snip action. It's not really that even, but it's so cute. Are you ready to go to Shell Island? Shell, yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Another beautiful day. We made it on the shuttle. It might be a bit windy. If you can't tell from my hair, it's crazy. It's actually really nice out. It's warmer here than it was back in Destin.
Surprisingly, my face doesn't feel too burnt this morning. I think because I kept up with my aloe yesterday. You don't look that red either. Yeah, the aloe helps. So it's the next morning. And these are the shells we picked up yesterday off of Shell Island. Got some really good ones. Can you imagine if these things were whole? These babies would be huge. Found some driftwood. This one had a little feather in it. And then I found this too. And I thought it was a nut, but I, I can't. We're thinking it's an unopened shell or. I don't know. Cause see how it has like um like a hinge thing on the side there? I washed my hair and everything yesterday. I feel like it was totally pointless because the boat ride was very windy and then once you got on the other side of the island where we were finding these shells, it was super windy, so my hair is like really tingly and I feel like a witch. There's like a fine line between like cute beachy and like witchy vibes and I feel like my hair is giving witchy vibes. <laughs> But yeah, we had a good time at Shell Island. It was really cool. It's like, I think they said seven miles of coastline there where you can walk and get shells like this. We didn't go like super far or anything, but the island itself is really pretty because you know, like, not that many humans are on it and there's no buildings and it's like more reserved and like birds nesting and all that. It had like the cool dunes and stuff. So that was kind of cool to see. And it was nice to take the boat ride over there. Also, if you know where you're going, to go to Shell Island, it's totally worth it to just like rent your own pontoon for the day because of it's. I think it's about $25 a person to get the, on the shuttle. And so by the time you go with like a group of people, you might as well just rent a pontoon boat and make your own way over there. And then you're, you're not like on a time crunch because they come like every hour. So you could stay there like all day, obviously. So that's a good little tip as well. If you have never been to Shell Island, I think it's worth it definitely something different and cool and it's so close um, to Destin it's like something you can go off and do for the day that's kind of like what we do um, we like to go to Pensacola and the seaside Rosemary Beach Alice Beach Panama City area um, and Shell Islands over there by Panama City so we thought we would check it out because my mom has heard of it before I never heard of it and it was just like something different for us to go and do yesterday so yeah it was fun I found this little coiled shell too. Can you imagine if that was still like not decomposed looking? I mean, it still looks really cool like this. It's giving like fossil vibes. <laughs> um, where, I know I found another one like this. Oh, here it is. Kind of cool. This was another kind of coiled one too. I mean, look at the detailing on that. I feel like the sun is kind of wanting to come out right now. I think there's some surfers out there. Or on some of uh, those like smaller boards. I don't know if they're actual surfboards. It's been pretty gloomy today so far, but I don't know. It's not looking too promising with these hazy clouds. But honestly, I'm not mad about it because I kind of am sunburned, so I could use a break from the sun. Kevin's got his coffee. Life is good. I look red? No, you're not bad at all. You just have like a nice flush to you. See, this is the type of joint you gotta dedicate to somebody. Let's make sure they're that special somebody. You know, a lot of girls be thinking my songs are about them. This is not to get confused. This one's for you. Baby, you my everything. You all I ever wanted. We could do it real big. Bigger than you ever done it. You be up on everything. Other hoes ain't never on it. I want this forever. I swear I could spend whatever on it. Cause she hold me down every time I hit up. When I get right, I promise that we gon' live it up. She made me beg for it till she give it up. And I say the same thing. Can we also just take a second and look at how small this driver is and compare? Like, this is my hand. And this is. Um, the washing machine. I mean, you could only do a tiny little load here. That is hilarious. But hey, they got it to fit. Okay. Oh, 
Also, another weird thing in this condo is they have this lip right here, a little ledge, if you will, and it's actually very dangerous if you're not paying attention. I literally almost just ripped my freaking toe off. I mean, there's it's got to be here for a necessary reason, but I mean, that thing is dangerous. It's about 11.30 now, and since it's kind of gloomy and just not really sunny today, like I said, so... I think we're gonna consider today a little shopping day and walk around maybe like Destin Commons, that kind of area. Um, I don't know, we'll see what we get up to. Probably hit up like H&M, you know, those kinds of places. Um, there's this other store we like too, I think it was called Coastal Outfitters. We found some cute items in there last time too, so we'll see what goodies we find today. Maybe we'll find nothing, I don't know. But oh, you always find something. <laughs> this is a little outfit. Got some shorts on, so plain little gray shirt because it's actually kind of humid today. So it's not really that cold, even though it's really gloomy. But if the sun was out today, it would be a really good beach day because it wasn't even that windy down at the ocean either. We, me and Devin did a quick little walk um, down to like Crab Trap area and back along the beach. Um, that takes us a little over 30 minutes to do and just getting our steps in but I'm sure we're gonna get a lot more in today just from walking around shopping and stuff but yeah I've been really liking this little tote bag I brought I can fit so much stuff in it and it just kind of goes with everything yeah I've been throwing down the whiskey So we went to a couple places today. Obviously H&M got um, two things from there. Then we went to the Marshalls out here and I got three things from there. And then we went in, in Alvin's of course. Devin and my mom got something. <laughs> Not much, but you know, we made the best of a gloomy day. I got these pants. And what size did I get these in? US too. They fit mm. really nice. They're a little more high waisted too. They felt kind of like a beachier vibe, cargo style. Try one of these. What is this? The dark chocolate? Hold on a second. But yeah, they just fit really cute and the length wasn't too long or anything. I just don't have anything like these, so I thought these were a little unique and different. And then I got this cutesy little t shirt. It's a really like bigger, oversized one. I got it in a size large and it still is bigger than that I think but I like how it just like hangs when I try it on it says breaking hearts I just like the graphic look on this one it even looks cute um, with the little cargo pants here and then for Marshalls I got this cropped little shirt this is actually an extra large but I liked how it fit when I tried it on it kind of looks like a men's shirt that was just like cut off it gave me like thrifted vibes but I liked it it's really soft too and this was only $7.99. And then I got another cropped little sweater and like the checked print, the green, like a cream white color. This was really cute too on. And I liked it. It was a little bit oversized. I got it in the large. And those were my finds today. I didn't buy anything else, did I? That was it, I think. Oh, I got these leggings. I almost didn't see these. Um, this was from the Jockey brand. These were on clearance for $10 in this cute little leopard print because I wear leggings all the time and these are really soft and I like the Jockey brand. So yeah, those were the finds today. Um, my hair definitely got crazy from the humidity today. Humidity? That was a weird way to say that. Another day, another morning, beach walk. The sun's wanting to peek through just a little bit. It was very, very foggy this morning to the point you could hardly see the ocean from our balcony. It's still really pretty though.
Getting us a self timer photo right there. Deb setting the camera up. We're going on a quick little hop, skip, and a jump to Camille's because it's literally right across our place over here. And we're going to get some fresh pressed orange juice because I haven't had any yet. And my brother and my dad have both gotten it like almost every morning so far. And they've been telling me how good it is. So I got to go get me one. Camille's, I don't think, did it last year because I remember asking one, one year. I was like, wanted the fresh orange juice they're like oh we don't do it this year so they brought it back thank goodness looks like we're gonna be having another pretty gloomy day today just like yesterday but as long as it's not raining we're good literally camille's is right there are we getting the orange juice i thought so all right It's like a shadow of shoes. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I think my orange juice at home tastes better. And this was like $5 for this tiny little cup. I wouldn't get it again. That's for sure. I walked back up to the room for a quick little outfit change because my sweater felt a little too hot. So Devin gave me his shirt. Which is a rare... Um, sighting here. Devin never lets me borrow his clothes. I don't know what the deal is. We are getting some more steps in now. So we only got like a little over two miles walking the beach this morning. So now we're going to walk to, I think maybe Whole Foods or some stuff in that area. I don't really know. Just trying to get some more steps in because that's what we do around here. We are walkers. We walk to everything. Like all people. <laughs> we love our walks. Doing a little cut through of Destin Commons where we were yesterday. Look what we have stumbled upon here for our coffee guy. <laughs> yeah, I tried the pink folder. Yeah. 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 We got all shifted and we went crazy. Had everything organized. Um, as you can tell, it looks like a little bit of a hot mess, but I grabbed like a wide variety of things I thought looked good, and this was vegan mac and cheese. I had to try it. Those were some smoky collard greens, some vegan Indian stuff, sweet potato. Devin got orange chicken and some rice. And now for dessert. We get to split this beautiful thing. How are we splitting this? Just bite it. Mm, my God. This is the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. Look at that butte sitting over there on the couch on the front porch. He is L-I-V-I-N. Well, I thought the fog was gonna get better, but definitely got worse my goodness I don't think you can see the ocean on the camera at all the Sun still won't speak through it's about five o'clock now and it's time for dinner and tonight we chose the circuit 